Hi, my name's Jaden. Hi, my name's Jessica. And we and are the, the Grasshopper, Grasshopper Moms. Moms. Um, our four children's names are Jumper and Baby, um, <laughs> Hopper, Hopper and Sweetie. Sweetie. <laughs> um, they have an enclosure, which we yeah. will show at the end of the video. That's opened. It won't stay taped shut. Oh, um, okay. We have Jumper with us. These are Lumber Cricket. I mean grasshoppers, I'm sorry. L lubber, not lumber. Sorry. Lubber. This one is Jumper, and she likes to jump. Like, a lot. Like, too much. <laughs> a little, just a little too much. Yeah. Um, some fun facts about them. They use their antennas to feel around. Because they are partially blind, I think. <laughs> um, they, the water source, the way they get their water is from their food. Like, when it's wet, they get their water and soak up the water. And I can give, like, an example. You can keep talking. Um, they eat lettuce. And there's flower stems in there. I need to get the food. I don't, he's on the food. She. Okay, so they eat lettuce and there's flower stems in there. Yes, which I highly recommend. She's on it right now, oh, actually. she's not anymore. She's so cute. Anyways, yeah. she's black and yellow, as you can see. And when I picked these lovers up, I had another one. It kind of... Yeah, her name was Harper. No, there was... I had five. I caught five of these at the beach. One of them died. Oh. And more, more of them died in the process trying to, trying to get some. <laughs> so I made a memorial for them. Deal with it. I'm so sorry for... And before you please. come at us mm. for having them in a small container, I promise you their actual home is not this small. And there are holes in the mm -hmm. top... These are just food in there like all the time. We make changes yeah. like every two, to one, every day, like or like every other day. And I actually just wash them. And if you're wondering how we wash them exactly, we have a spray bottle. We literally just take the spray bottle and spray the inside of their mm -hmm. enclosure and get it all nice and moist, which is also another way that they can get their source of water. Yes. Um. I think the smallest one we have is Baby, and the reason why we call her Baby is because she's the smallest. I think the oldest is probably Hopper. Yes. Hopper is pretty big mm -hmm. compared to the all, most of them, because all the smaller ones are probably that big, maybe. Like, okay, wait. Let me tell the story about Harper. And, Har and Harper was, like, that big. She was... She, she was, wasn't like that big. She was like that big, but bigger she was than probably Hopper. like a preteen, maybe. At first, I called them. I don't know if it's a guy or a girl. I called them Hopper, but I think it's a girl. I think it was a girl. So I called right. them Harper, and, and <laughs> she kind of passed. And it's because I've been. I was going through some stuff. Like we had, um, just came back from the beach, and. I was like drained and I couldn't I was sleeping all the time so I couldn't change her enclosure like she still had food but I need to change her enclosure like Oops. every day so yeah and I found her in my backyard these ones I found at the beach there was a ton I could have got more but I only had one container to fit all five in Mm -hmm. So it was hard to, yeah. I actually owned a beetle before this, um, mm -hmm. but my beetle, um, I was holding her. Her name was Strawberry. She was baby, like baby. And I was holding her, and she was pulling my fingers, and she fell on my shirt. And then I went to look, and she fell into my carpet, which is about that thick. <laughs> yeah. And it's, like, really 
fake carpet. So she's still in here somewhere, or she was eaten by my cats. And Which I really hope she <laughs> she's still in here, hopefully. And these ones you can tell are girls because we think we are per, like 50% sure that the males are, what was it, origin? Or, orange is red, and they still have a line that's yellowed on the back. I didn't find any, I found them like at first, and I didn't have a container, so we had to go back home and get a container. And then by the time I got back, they were gone. All the male, I think. Gone. So we have all girls in yeah. our. And Hopper does sound like a boy name, but it doesn't matter. That's what suits her matter. the most, and that's yeah. we had two really athletic jumpers out of the four: Hopper and Jumper. And this is Jumper. Hopper, this Jumper is bigger. And yeah, Harp, and Hop Hopper Jumper is like younger but still jumps a lot yeah and hopper actually jumps more than jumper i think i don't know we haven't really got oh they're all they're all there yeah um so if that's all we'll probably make another video going over what they eat and stuff like that and like a daily routine for the routine routine for them. Yeah, so we, all the food at once. we kind of like break it up because I got the stem bottoms from my mom's bouquet of roses she got for Valentine's Day, and I had to cut all of those up, like Oops. the day she threw them away, I had to go get them and cut them up and put them in a thing, because that was the only thing my beetle was eating, and now that's all I really have for them, and they're you still get eating lettuce. It. Yeah, but... Lettuce works for my grasshoppers. And if you guys ever do get a like something like that, I 100% recommend you don't feed them like five things at once because after a while you're going to run out and once you run out it's going to be kind of hard as to find those things especially with the flower stems. Also because okay. So if you have lettuce and you put water on it like you spray it with water so that because that's how they get the water so that you would just do that and put it in there and then when it gets hot it soaks up all the water and then when it gets cold the, all the water like, spills out and it's like a pool a puddle of water that's why you always have to clean their cages and or enclosures they poop a lot yeah they poop like 20 times in a minute they... at least harper did like a harper did a lot harper i think had an issue <laughs> These ones aren't actually pooping that much, and I recommend that and you put down. And they're in a shelf, so that's probably not going to be so good. So we're going to go put them together back, and we're going to videotape it for you guys. Because, yeah. Yeah. you can flip the camera on that. Okay. So, so don't mind that container right there. Okay. This, put the children back to this is the enclosure. I'm gonna put the light back in here real quick. Uh, <laughs> Let me put the light in here. They're all right there. There's two up there. Two up there, and then one right there. Right there. And so, and this is the food, which we'll go over their diet later. Um, let me put up some of their toys. Let me make sure she's... toys. 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 Like, cause they like to jump. So like. Oh, that's cute. And I, I have that. this random thing in here. I was they like to go so on this. And I was like, oh, wait. So basically, all I do is take this. And no, this does not hurt the animal doing this. I 100% I, I reassure you, it doesn't. Because, ooh, I'm trying not to. a hard lid to sheesh get off of there yeah we're kid friendly by the way so yeah and this is just okay jump bird please don't jump because <laughs> we know that's what you love to do okay and out oh oh oh, 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 oh. <laughs> okay i gotta get this oh we need more tape yeah 
Oh, like, she's on the lid again. I don't think she wants to go back. I don't know. Okay. Um, we will be right back. We will be. We will see you guys in video number two. Bye, guys. Bye. <laughs>